So tonight we're going to make a wheelchair pocket bag. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to take a piece of material and cut a two inch strip to make the ties for our bag. Before we get started, so we'll take that and cut a strip two inch. Okay, the next thing we're going to do, we're going to cut the piece for our bag. So we're going to make our bag, we'll measure it up. 12 inches so we'll give it 13 inches to be able to have a little bit of seam line so we'll measure that out make our 13 inch bag and cut it and then we have our material here that's going to become our bag so we're going to kind of fold it up like this and then we'll make our flap and by making our flap we're going to kind of make it like an envelope so i just kind of cut it like this just to get a little bit of That's kind of how we do our bag. I can kind of double check it. By retrimming it again. So we have a nice looking flap. Like that. And what we're gonna do is Cut where the fold is to separate the two pieces, like so. The next step we're going to do is we're going to take sew our strips. So we're going to fold this together and we're going to sew along the half inch. Uh, quarter inch selvage so that we can cut this up to make our tie straps for our wheelchair bag. So we're going to sew that. After we sew that, we're going to put the right side in. And we're going to sew it exactly the same so that we have, we're going to sew along this edge and we're going to sew along this edge. Same thing with this flap. We're going to keep them matched up so that we sew along the same edges. So we're going to sew along here and sew along here. So now we're going to sew the ends of our ties and we'll give it about a quarter inch selvage. So ties that we'll put on the side then we're going to take just one side of our bag and we're going to start just below 
here so that when we sew it together we can turn it inside out and have a, a, a lining with this so we'll sew it just below here and about a quarter inch selvage <laughs> Same for the other side. And we'll do a quarter inch selvage. And we stop about there. And we do the same for the other pocket where we have a quarter inch selvage starting just below the raw edge here okay okay so now that we have our two pieces of our bag we're going to actually turn one part of the bag inside out so we can do it by hand and just turn it inside out like such okay and what we're going to do is we're going to tuck it on the inside of our other piece. Okay. And that way the two pieces, the bag is lined. So I just kind of tuck it in like this to make the corners match. And I tuck this in to make the corner match. And you can kind of line them up, tuck it in. And just line the two pieces up nicely so that they fit in with each other. So they should match up really nicely so that you have the two sides with the right side in together and we're going to sew starting from the middle across here stop and we'll put our little ties in after we've turned them inside out on the side here and on the side here okay to make the ties we have our nice little tie here we need this little tool and we're gonna pull the right side out. So I just kind of slide it in like this and then we turn it right side out. So it takes a little bit of practice, but little by little, we will get it pulled up. Okay, so we just kind of stretch it out and pull, stretch it out, pull. Stretch it up, pull, stretch it up, pull. And we have what's going to be our ties. And what I do is we can iron it to make it look a little nicer. And we can cut it up into four even pieces. four nice ties and what I do is I tie the end of what's going to be the outside of the tie just to keep it from fraying like that so that we get four nice ties once we have the four nice ties such we are getting ready to sew our bag so when it comes to sewing our bag I'm going to tuck this tie on the inside next to the seam here where the bag is and just make sure that it's on the inside and what we'll do is we'll start from the middle 
and we will sew down our tie. And then I stop right at where the edge is, and I'm just going to tuck it in, and I bring it out, trim the threads. Then I take my next tie. And I'm gonna put it right in between this next area here, behind the seam, like that. And so then we have our two flaps. And how I sew, and make sure it's sticking out a little bit so you know that it's gonna sew. And we're gonna actually open up the seam here and we're going to sew part of the tie down and kind of match it up and we're going to sew it flat and we'll keep sewing around open and trim it and I'll take our next set of ties what I do is I tuck the tie in at the same spot just like the other one near the seam here like that and what I'll do is I kind of find where the seam is and I'm going to sew here to here leaving this part open and I leave about three inches open to make it easy to turn it inside out. So now that we have the flap here, we're going to tuck our tie here and sew the last tie in. This part's a little bit tricky, but we stick it in the hole, the little gap we have. Just run it all the way in. that it lays flat right against here. So now I put the two edges of this seam together so it's flat and I'm going to sew down the flap. Okay. Once I have that flap in, I will take my pinking shears and I will trim around the edges. So I just kind of trim off the excess part so that it folds nicely. So I kind of fold it like that. And the fun part is turning it inside out. So where we have the opening, we're gonna pull it all out just turn the whole piece inside out. Okay. And we've got it inside out. And we find the corners. It's inside out. And we're going to find our flap, which is turned inside out. And so it looks kind of funny like this, but now we tuck inside of our bag in and we get 
the preliminary look of our simple wheelchair bag. So this flap, I can turn a little bit more out. And then we kind of fold this down. And as you can see, we have our wheelchair bag. And I tend to iron it. And then after that words, we'll top stitch it. Okay, so now our wheelchair bag is pressed. We're going to sew top stitch around the top and top stitch around here to make it nice. And then afterwards, we have our nice wheelchair bag to hang on the inside the pocket, inside handle of the wheelchair. simple tie on wheelchair bag that is very very easy to make and easy to put on easy to wash and easy to put valuables in on the inside of the wheelchair